Good day, everyone. I hope everybody had an awesome Friday. That's the day. Well, technically it's Saturday. It's 2.15 a.m. And I just walked in the door from a fun time at Mafia. So, first of all, I worked 12 to 6 at Planet Smoothie. Um, pretty good shift. Started out a little rough with the crew members that were there. Um, who were much more versed in what was going on. And any questions I had, they would usually not answer. Which was a little bit frustrating. Um, sometimes, like, working together as a team was not really in sync all that much. Um... But then at 3 o'clock, they left. A little bit after that, someone else came in. Um, and the two of us worked better than the three of us did before that. So, um, we'll see. Um, an interesting conversation with the owner, my friend, who's the owner, um, right before my shift started. I won't go into details about that. Um, but he said a few things, and I've got something to think about. Basically, we'll leave it at that. Um, for now. We'll see what happens if anything concrete develops. Um, hmm. Came home, got some dinner. Boom, boom, boom. Jesse came by, picked me up, and we went, the two of us went down to Mafia Party at the home of the of my boss, the owner of Plant Smoothie, who got me the job, yada, yada, yada. And we played Mafia all night. We played... How many games did we play? We played one, two... Did not play a third game. Started two, three, four. I think four games total. Four and a half. <laughs> um, first game was a basic game. We just had, I think, four... Ma yeah, we did four Mafia, one cop, one nurse. The rest were town. And, wow, this... They're starting to blend together. We're playing Mafia more often, to where each game stands out less and less, just because I have so many of the games filed away in my brain, because it was so much fun. Um, what was I? I was... I was town... No, I was... Nurse. Yeah, I was Nurse in the first game. Um... And so I would save myself until the cop comes forward, typically. Um, so we're trying to figure out the mafia and all this stuff. And basically, I... We get to the point where... Um, it is somewhat revealed to some of the people who are listening. Because Jesse decided to say it out loud. Um, but not super loud. So some people heard, some people didn't. That I was the nurse. So what happened was... Um, the first round, my boss was the first victim of the Mafia. And I saved myself, but they didn't go after me. The second round, they went after me, and I saved myself. And so some people were like, he could be the nurse. And then Jesse just basically turned to me, and he's like, yeah, you might as well tell him. Or, yeah, you're definitely the nurse, or something like that. And some people heard that, some people didn't. And so I was not sure which way to play it, because I knew not, I knew not everyone heard it. So I tried to play it as though it wasn't revealed, um, so what happened next was, um, I'm trying to remember, the, um, what we're doing is we're, pi we, we're picking off, the cops doing a good job, the town's doing a good job, and we're picking off the mafia, it's working rather effectively, we're down to one mafia left, um, the numbers are getting smaller, there was a round where the mafia didn't go after me, um, and we didn't have a cop pinned down, but then the next round, the cop came out as the cop, he said, I'm the cop, this is what we found out, uh, whatever, whatever, and then they're like, all right, nurse, save the cop, and I'm thinking, yeah, I could save the cop, but then I'm a sitting duck, and if I don't save the cop, if I do save the cop, and they go after me, because they figure, because Mafia is some of the ones that heard that I was the nurse, then the cop's just as vulnerable next round, and we'll only find a little bit more information out. So I need to save myself, and so I was hoping that the Mafia would assume I was going to save the cop, and not myself, and they decided that they were going to swing after me again. The last Mafia was 
my partner usually in the game when we bounce ideas off of each other. It just happened he was Mafia and he was sitting across the way instead of next to me like he usually is. And he decided to go after me again because he thought the nurse would save the cops so he didn't go after the cop they knew about. Um, turns out he should have because I did save myself. And I, unbeknownst to him, was the nurse. I saved myself. And so he went after me. Um, no, actually he did. He was one of the ones that did here. I was the nurse. So he thought I saved the cop. He goes after me. I saved myself. I was safe. And it was either him or actually Jesse. It was the last two options we had. And we decided to go for him for whatever reason. I'm not sure what it was. I was really wasn't sure which of the two of them it could have been. Um, I just knew they both knew that I was the nurse. <sighs> and so we uh, ended the game by lynching him and there's no mafia left. Game two was kind of a rough game. We had to restart at one point. Um, another reason why it's hard to keep track of what it was that I was because we kept restarting over and over. Um, I was the godfather at one point and it got pulled away from me. Um, the one role I still haven't been is Batman. Um, so I was a cop in a game, I guess. That was the third game. I don't remember much about the second game because it was done in a weird way. I was I was out early, so we started another game. We went outside. It took us a while to start. It was a small game. We had two Mafia, uh, me as the f silencer, as a, me as the silencer, and Jesse was the godfather, it turned out. Me and Jesse, the only two Mafia. And we had a Batman, and Batman struck and killed Jesse, leaving me as the only Mafia. And we only got, like, one day in, and we decided, the other game ended, we decided we were going to just quit the game. Because it was short, and it was probably going to end pretty quick, unless I managed to pull off a win. Um, they were probably going to go after me pretty quickly, most likely. Just because I'm one of the players, based on the players that were out there, one of the more experienced players, and likely a bigger threat. So, um... It probably wasn't going to last much longer anyways, but we decided to quit the game and go back inside for game number three, four-ish. We'll go with game three. That, that We'll say that other one didn't count. So game three, I'm the, that was when I got the Godfather card, and they had to reset and redo it. So I lost Godfather, and I got Cop instead. Um, and so as the Cop, I um, I was paired off with one other Cop. And we had to investigate and figure out who was Mafia. And if we if we investigated the right person, we were told he was guilty. The other wrong person, he was innocent. We had to keep digging. So what happened was we investigated this one guy. Um, he was innocent. So um, then uh, one of the guys said, the cop should come forward. Even though they shouldn't really have at that point. The cop would come forward and tell us what they found out. And I'm thinking, no... And so both me and the other cop decide we're not going to do that. And then some other guy says, I'm the cop. And he clears someone else. And so I'm like, I can't let this stick. So I come out risking everything. And some people were suspicious of me because, um, as it turned out, it was Mafia that was pushing that boat. Um, no, actually it wasn't. Because um, it was someone else. So... Um, so I'm like, I'm the cop, we investigate this person, um, and I'm only coming forward, I would not come forward normally, um, unless I was the cop is the only way I'd come forward, because I don't want us going in the wrong direction as a town. And so he, um, we decided, we, we were trying to, they're trying to decide whether he was telling the truth, whether I was telling the truth, which one of us was cop, which one of us was obviously lying and had to be mafia. And then the person that he cleared, of all of, the mem of all of his partners, all the other members of Mafia, um, she started breaking down, she covered her face, she started blushing and turning red, and just gave away that she was Mafia. And so we're like, she's Mafia, he's Mafia, because he said she was innocent. Um, so there was also guns involved, because um, the gunsmith was there, so a gun was given to me as the cop a gun was given to my boss 
as a big player in the game also. And so the two of us had a gun each. So we could each use it one time. And so we're sitting there. Um, we know two mafia. So we lynch one. And then we're hoping Batman's going to take care of the other one. Batman does take care of the other one. At the same time, Mafia takes care of Batman. So Batman's wiped out of the game, but we're down from four Mafia to two Mafia, just like that. So we got to figure out who the two Mafia are. And we're not really sure. We didn't have much to go on. Um, and just kind of randomly, my boss decides he's going to use his, and he gets the guy sitting right next to him, between me and him. And he was Mafia. Lucky guess. All right. That worked, and then they're like, we don't want to go to bed, we don't want to do any lynching, we want you to use your gun. And I'm like, we want to use a gun on who? And it could be Jesse, it could be this guy, it could be her. And so we're like down to three people, and um, Jesse was a little bit in my ear more than I would like, because it turned out he was the mafia. He got me to, sh with my gun, shoot the nurse, which was my lifeline, the person saving, keeping me alive. Um... So I did, and then we were down to only two options at that point, and one made, and Jesse made more sense than the other one. So we took Jesse out uh, with a lynching, and Town wins the game, thanks in large part to the act, the effort of the active, outspoken cop that was me. Last game, game four. Um, we get our um, super moderator in. <laughs> This guy does a really good job every time of keeping the game going and going fast, going exciting. So um, if he'd been there earlier, we would have had probably five, maybe even six matches, maybe, or games of Mafia, whatever you want to call it. So basically, um, I, be I was the arsonist. And the arsonist is um, a member of the Mafia, but I don't wake up with the rest of the Mafia. I wake up separately, so I don't know who the Mafia is, and the Mafia doesn't necessarily know who I am. So I make a symbol over my head, as best I can, of an A, um, like this. Say A for arsonist, while the Mafia is awake, hoping that some of them get the message. Turned out one of them didn't know what I was doing. He's like, what's with the A? She figured out it was an A, but she didn't know why I was giving an A. And I was like, I'm the arsonist, I'm on your side, don't kill me. Um, basically is what the message was. And I guess the rest of the Mafia got it because they didn't kill me. And as the arsonist, I get to douse someone with gasoline um, in the game, you know, not really. Um, <laughs> and then uh, whenever I want, one person every night, and whenever I want, I can light a match and eliminate everyone that I've doused. And so I'm thinking I want to do, I want to eliminate um, the host of the party and my boss because he's a strong player, and basically I want to get rid of all the strong players, so... I want to do him, but he's been eliminated every single round first that night, like tonight. And so I was like, is this going to happen again? So I waited on him. And instead, I doused this one other guy who's also a big threat, I thought. who This guy wound up being Mafia, but I couldn't have known that. And so I would have taken out a Mafia in the process. But the gunsmith gave him, my boss, the gun a gun, and so my next choice was obvious, and I doused him, my boss. Uh, my plan was to continue on by dousing three other strong players, hoping I made five rounds at least, and then strike, and five strongest players in the game eliminated. Unfortunately, number one, uh, my boss was actually one of the cops, and he had a gun, and they investigated, um, but he, he didn't come forward. We didn't know that until after the game. And so he investigated the guy, the first guy that I doused. And so the second guy that I doused used his gun to kill the first guy that I doused. Outing him was Mafia right after another member of Mafia had just been taken out with a lynching from the town. Um, so there goes two Mafia down right away. And then the other cop decides to come forward, not as the cop, but decides to come forward because he said he saw me give some tells. So, um, I gotta work on my poker face a little bit. Thinking maybe my lack of facial hair may have given away a little bit of excitement in my mouth because, or something. 
because he said that I looked excited, and so he he knew I had a card that was made me excited. Whether so, it wasn't a townsperson is basically what it was, and so he threw everyone my way. Um, they decided not to vote me out. Jesse was actually the first one taken out by the mafia, um, and so they decided not to. So they spared me. They went after someone else, got rid of him, and then, um, I need to wrap this up, but I'm almost to the end, I promise. Um, and the next time, um, Mafia actually takes out the guy who went after me, and they silence the girl who was also thinking, agreeing with him very vocally that it could be me. And so, that combined with, um, the fact that he, that the guy had made some good points, um, caused everyone to vote for me, eliminate me, take out the arsonist, and that's it. And then the game progressed, the Yaku there was, uh, Yakuza struck, turned someone else, they immediately figured out who that was, ultimately it came down to one mafia left, and, um, an alliance, well, Batman's on the t side of the town, but an alliance between the cops and Batman, Knocked out the last Mafia, and Town won the last game. That's about it. A lot of fun. Really enjoy it. Tomorrow is, or today for you guys watching this, it is the 4th of July. So, happy Independence Day for all of my United States American viewers, which I believe is, the best of my knowledge, everyone that watches um, there might be some out there, but nobody ever answers my calls to leave comments or whatever on the video on Facebook or on YouTube or anything like that. So, feel free to give me a thumbs up if you like my Mafia night. Uh, it's probably long. If you don't care about Mafia, you probably shut it down already by now. But I'm going to have to wrap it up now. So, I'm going to say goodnight everyone, and I'll see you tomorrow.